How's it going guys? Today we're going to be playing some... Catherine! Exactly! So let's just hop into it. Enjoy I can't game. wait to play this game. <laughs> like I don't want to go hard, but I don't want to not be able to get past the stages. Experienced players, yes. I am very experienced. Okay, strange tale. I'm actually really looking forward to this. Um, this game came out years ago, I want to say. I don't, I'm not, I don't know, I can't give you a, an exact date. But it's an old game, let's say that. So it's basically a puzzle game. Um, but, you, you know, you, you're playing it for the story, really. The puzzle is, the puzzle is good. The puzzle, puzzle side of the game is fun. Um, but I think you are genuinely playing for the story. Cut here and I go back and I change it to easy. When the night sky fills with glamour, a lovely story awaits you. Good evening. Damn that hair. I, I reckon she gets the volume. Your guide for the night is me. The Midnight Venus, Trisha. Have you heard about this scary rumor? They say if you fall in a dream and don't wake up before you land, you die in real life. Tonight's story is Catherine. An unconventional romantic horror. A man with a certain <laughs> curse has a terrifying week. Our hero in this story is Vincent Brooks, age 32. He's an earnest and kind man. But one day, we begin to see him have terrifying nightmares. On top of that, a torrent of sweet seduction swoops down upon him. Mmm. What a playboy, huh? Will he be able to overcome all the blocks in his life? His outcome... The metaphors. ...depends on you, viewers. Sorry to keep you waiting. Raise the curtains. Now enjoy the show. Until we meet again. I'll try not to talk over the cutscenes as much, because, you know, I know that... You guys will want to understand the story. Hey, where'd you go? Snap out of no. it! Were you even listening? Uh, sure. You know, you've been a little out of it lately. Is everything all right? You've been spacing out left and right. Oh, sorry. I uh, had to work early this morning. Yeah. Oh, this this beat. Oh, I'm just here. Head bang into it. Wait, it's in Japanese. I thought it was English, oops. Still up. Damn. Level 100 boss. Dead beep. Nice boxes, man. Is this place? 
Okay, so yeah. What we're going to be doing is we basically have to keep climbing um, the staircase each night. If you fall, you're dead. I'll die. You fucking serious? Just wake up, bro. Use the directional pad to move. Okay. So we're just going to keep going up. Move the blocks to make a path. You can climb one block at a time, right? How am I supposed to move these things? Press the A button. You are strong. You can also undo your... Use it oh, that's cool. I didn't know you could undo it as well. Alright, cool. I didn't know this. Alright. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have... Alright, here we go. Here we go. Picking up a mystic pillow will grant you an additional continue. If you see one, make an effort to get it. It'll be worth the effort. Okay, it's probably like a life, isn't it? Oh, it's a retry, yeah. Wait, hang on. Oh, I can pull them out, can't I? There we go. There we go. Don't just push blocks around without thinking about it. They'll collapse, and you can put yourself into an impossible situation. Collapse? Moving blocks around carelessly can make things more difficult for you. First, try pulling a block. Okay. Oh my, oh my god. Imagine dying on the tutorial. I fucking ran off. Oh. Okay, we're back. Alright. Moving blocks around carelessly. Yep. Yep. I would, wouldn't have restarted it, but I just, I just didn't want to lose a pillow on the first day. These blocks. What's that supposed to mean? They connect at the. Even if a block. Yeah. Has the edges That's where that whole thing where they keep shouting edge out is. Edge. There we go. All right, I got it. Edge. All right. See how the. Doesn't make any sense. What about gravity? About well, we're in a dream, man. You, like, use, the use your head. All right. Where is the? As you near the top, you will hear a bell ring. The exit is near. Hurry. All right, cool. If we both make it out of here, I'll... Hey, hey, wait a sec! Let's go then. All right, I got it. Edge. All right, I got it. Edge. All right, I got it. There we go. I can get out through here. We did it. We did the tutorial. I'm so proud of me. <laughs> Yay! Gold prize for the tutorial. Pillow abuse. Uh, hello? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll be in today's code review meeting. Really? No, no, I'm just, uh, just a little under the weather. No, no, it's okay. I'll be right there. Yeah. Um, sorry.
So are you getting anything extra for this? For what? For all this overtime you're doing. Oh, uh, not this time. This time? Do you usually get overtime pay? Well, no, but... So you don't get anything? <sighs> mm. uh. Here, two sugars. Hey, Catherine. Have you ever had a dream where you died? You mean like where you're in danger? No. No, where you actually die. You're being killed or something. No. I usually do the killing in my dreams. <laughs> well, that sounds like you. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Hey, how many years have we been together? Huh? How many years? I'm asking you. It's just, my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Oh. She's worried about me. She knows I've got a career that keeps me busy, but... Yeah. I mean, it's easy to keep things like they are now, but... I don't know. Sometimes easy's best, right? I mean, who knows what'll happen in the future? I suppose. other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled hey, out. Hey, change it! The Chief match is on! Chief said that attempts are being oh, made to kill over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So, who are you betting on? Come on, pick one. Are you kidding? Women's wrestling? What I know. Sounds to me like she finally wants you to tie the knot. Uh, you think so too? What else could it be? I've known you since we were kids, but wow, you. Married, huh? Hey, nothing set in stone yet. What, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? It's not that. I love her, but I don't think we need to run out and get married. You know, it's it's like we're comfortable where we are. Are you? Uh, that's what she said. Her job's always most important to her. I mean, you know she's always been the ambitious type, right? It doesn't mean she'll always be like that. That's not what I mean. Besides... You're single, too. Hey, I'm still looking for my soulmate. <laughs> I'm not like you. I've already told my girl that I'm not interested in marrying her. What if you never meet your soulmate? Then I'll never get married. So what? That sounds just like you, Chief. Anyway, did you hear about Paul? He's dead. Paul? Oh. Wait. That Paul? He's dead? Yeah. I heard he just got divorced, but he looked healthy. It's a complete shock. What happened to him? An accident? I don't know. Apparently his mother just found him dead in his room this morning. This morning? Wait, you mean... Yeah. The mystery death on the news? That was him. Holy shit! No way! Maybe we'll all wind up dead tomorrow, too. Shut the hell up. Man, I hate the news. They're always trying to push their agenda for ratings. Toby, you are really easy to mess with. <laughs> well, speaking of crazy stuff this morning, I pissed the bed for the first time since grade school. What? Oh, that's messed up, man. <laughs> I had a really scary dream. But I don't remember what it was about. Oh, man. How old are you? 32. I know that. You know, I don't think I need to hear this. Shut up. I was really fucking scared, all right? Oh, where you guys?
guys going? Stick around. I, I don't want to go home just yet. So? Why don't you have Catherine meet you here? No, I just saw her today. Besides, she'd get mad at me if I told her. Ah, jeez. What does she see in this poor fool? Sorry, but I gotta be in early tomorrow. Don't drink too much, okay? All right. Take care, Vince. See you later. Check your text messages and save. Why would I need to save? Be sure to read them when they come. Okay. Oh, it's like Persona. I mean, I know it's by the same developers, but it just feels so cool. Like I said before, I'm having dinner with some old friends, and so it's surprising most of them have are already married. Ooh, yikes! And almost half of them have kids. They're all showing off pictures of their families, and it makes me look. I thought maybe it's time for us to. Yes. Yeah. 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 This is this is a good thing. Uh. Okay. 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 Yeah, we just did that. When certain words and actions change Vincent's inner ideas, a meter will be shown. Oh, we got a change in story. I love that. Vincent's words and actions will affect the story. Remember it. Okay. So I'm not going to try and go for either the hard good ending or the hard bad ending. I'm going to just go with what? You know. Marriage, huh? Figure this would happen. What I think, should we say, or what I think we should do. I don't want to give her trouble. You got me. Spam? Yeah, successfully completed stage one. Oh yeah. Ah, bringing up her parents out of the blue? It's not like her. Oh my god. You got mail. Very popular. You drinking out of the stray shoe again? You know you have work tomorrow. Geez, take it easy, okay? Guilty as charged. I'll make sure I don't drink enough to get a hangover. Take care of yourself. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah, see, see, this is nice. It's just a nice thing to say. You should always, you should always, you know, make sure, you know, with your girlfriend or whatever to, you know, make sure that you're okay and understand where they're coming from, etc. Uh, it's late. You're about to go to the next scene without saving. Are you sure you want to continue? Uh, are you sure you want to continue without saving? No, definitely not. I want to make sure. How do I save? I didn't, I didn't get that, but it was the diary. Yeah, it was the diary, okay. Cool. Weird, isn't it? There's like other tables. Hey, 
Here we go. The second night. It's you. What are you waiting for? The second day. <laughs> Oh my god, we've got a heck of a way to go. Where am I? Last Prison of Despair. Again? What the hell? I was at the bar and this girl came in and then... Damn it, I can't remember. What is going on? You passed out, clearly. from last night? Yep. Listen, watch out for the cracked blocks. They'll break after you step on them. There are several types of... Oh, I see it. I see them. We are going at an extremely fast rate. Look at that. Oh, shit. Oh. Good, because I was a little bit worried. If you try to move to a space without a block, you'll hang as well. From there, you can move around. Okay. All right. Cool. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. Wait. How? Now what? <laughs> Shit. Edge. <laughs> Shit. Hang on. Oh, I think I fucked myself. Andy. Shit. Right. <laughs> hang on. What am I doing? Budge. <laughs> hang on. What am I doing? Oh no. Edge. That's what I wanted to do. Can I not climb? Can we actually just not climb? Oh god, this is why we had to go on easy. Shit. Uh. Shit. Fuck. Edge. It's definitely not that. No. Oh my god, I'm stuck already. This is why. This is why I changed the difficulty. Oh my god. Edge. Whoa. Shit. Fuck, I gotta make sure I don't do that as well. Edge. Push that again. Edge. Push that one more. Edge. I was gonna say, is there anything behind here? No. Hey, well. Right, I got it. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I gotta pull. Oh, what the hell? I'm gonna point at my screen then. Alright, I got it. Because there's no way I can do that. I just froze. Gets rid of it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Right. Alright, I got it. Alright, I got it. Got you. Got you. I'm I'm clever. If you can't see ahead of you, try looking around. You might find an easy path. Use the right stick if you're stuck. Spring! We're gonna get out of here! Alright. Oh, wrong one. Edge. 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 There we go. Almost there. You can also push rows of blocks. Rows of block. There's no limit. Okay. Edge. Edge. All right, I got it. When you touch a checkpoint, you will start from there. <laughs> All right, cool. That's cool. I'm glad that we have checkpoints. Right, We're gonna go grab that as well. Edge. All right, I got it. You've come pretty far. Good job. Yeah, man. Who's everyone? Edge. Edge. Right, I got it. I made it! Yeah. 
Cool. See, yeah, that's why we changed the difficulty, because I am not very clever. Place once, it's all over. You'll keep coming back every night. Every night? You're kidding me. We all have the same fate here. If you don't want to die, you've got to climb. So if I climb, I'll be saved? There's no guarantee. But take a look at that. See that bell? It's like a church or something. A church? If we can reach the top, there may be a way to escape. So there is a way. Like I said, there's no guarantee. But we've got to believe. It keeps us sane. Got to believe. Quit with all the dying stuff. I I'll do whatever you say. Just, just help me. Look, from here on out, I'm afraid you're on your own. I'm going now. No, no, no. No, no, wait. You hurry, too. Hey! You can't be serious. can save your progress and talk with the other sheep. Go on, talk to them. Well, we're going to save it there anyway, because we've done quite a bit today. So, um, anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy this first look at Catherine. Um, let me know if you want to see more, because it is it is an interesting game. I, like, I really like it, so, uh, yeah, peace out, guys.